Tom Quinn, the longtime royal biographer, reveals that former Soho client Tom Quinn exposed Meg's real relationship with Tom and Skip before marrying Harry in her youth. Contrary to popular belief, Meg was surprised by the boring and humiliating life within a deeply hierarchical and traditional institution when she received the big diamond ring on her left hand. According to a Kensington Palace employee who knew Meg well, she was enormously disappointed with the difference between her expectations as a global superstar and the reality of being treated as a servant of the people, having to follow strict rules and limitations on what she could do or say. Additionally, the same employee reported that the former Suits actress was dazzled by the possibility of becoming a world-famous princess but was shocked to discover the strict palace protocol and the fact that she could never be first in the order of precedence. Furthermore, Quinn interviewed a friend of Harry's from their partying days, an individual who probably drank countless vodkas with Red Bull while pouring peach schnapps and rum down the pants of the former party princess. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel to know all about the biggest events of the royal couple. According to a friend of Harry, known as the Met Office, it's possible to assume that his nickname is something like Bunter or Binky. When you are an American celebrity and socialize with other celebrities in the United States, it's common to get used to people around you constantly praising your skills and qualities. Meghan didn't like the UK because, as a member of the royal family, she realized that she would be treated not as a celebrity but as a servant of the people. Harry's old friend, Tom Inskip, is said to have had the longest relationship and went through a confusing situation shortly after Harry started dating Meghan. At that time, the Duchess always avoided contact with Tom and spoke ill of him, which led Harry to end their friendship. The couple's biography, written by Omid Scobie and Caroline Durand, almost confirms speculation, stating that Inskip advised Harry and Meghan to live together before making any serious decisions. According to the authors of the book about the royal couple, a source close to them stated that although Inskip's advice was well-intentioned, Harry was hurt by the lack of trust in his judgment. Inskip's wife, Laura Hughes Young, also reportedly faced consequences for expressing reservations about Harry and Meghan's relationship. Some sources speculate that Inskip may have been one of Meghan's former clients, as he was known to frequent yachts with beautiful women on board. Meghan was photographed on a yacht several times, raising questions about her connections to Soho House and her relationship with Inskip. However, the Duchess reportedly made a great effort to conceal the truth.